All right, here we go, Jake Power. Here we go, man. It is uh, news time. All right, we're talking about a lot of these lawsuits, and today we're going to talk about a Dish Network TV and ons uh, lawsuit and what has happened with regards to the TV add ons. With regards to the TV, you know, the TV add ons, Cody thing, uh, their website is still up. All oh, breaking news coming in off the wire here. I'm going to bring it to you here shortly. Um, as we do all of the ongoing news that happens and on a daily basis and all the investigations going into different entities out there as always never panic uh, just VPN yourself as always you know what's going on out there by now all right so we're gonna skip ahead and for all you guys that have joined the revolution here at Jack Bauer channel, tell your grandma, tell your mom and dad, tell the boys and girls. We're going to do more than butt challenges. We do news, we do VPN talk, we do apps, Nintendo, Cody, you name it. Uh, we talk about everything for everybody that has subscribed to join the fight here at the Jack Bauer YouTube channel. I'm still not too sure. The jury is out with regards to uh, Terrarium TV. Everybody's telling me that it's done. I'm still holding out hope that it is not. But this is for sure. The TV add-ons and Dish Network settlement is done. Uh, put it behind us now. Hopefully that this issue is over. Uh, as that lawsuit started and we started reporting here on the Jack Bauer channel, it just opened up a whole wave of everything going down the tubes. So the TV add-ons and Dish Network uh, settle copyright infringement lawsuit. TV add-ons has announced that it has reached a settlement with Dish Network. As a result, the U.S. lawsuit will be dropped now. All right. The lawsuit will be dropped. They've reached a settlement. Of course, it's going to be about money. TV add-ons has promised to expedite Dish's DMC notices uh, going forward. Uh, meanwhile... Pretty much TV add-ons, uh, site the Canadian legal battle continues uh, with regards to TV add-ons, but the USA TV add-on settlement is over. Last year, American Satellite Broadcast provided Dish Network targeted TV add-ons. TV add-ons was the largest repository for the third-party Cody add-ons. You know that Cody thing that everybody was using, and when this thing went uh, south, that pretty much has brought an end to everything now Cody and APK related. TV add-on is that his Canadian founder Adam Lackman were accused of copyright infringement facing millions of dollars in potential damages. Wow. Well, why not? We're going to get you for all the millions we can because uh, the Dish Network itself seems to be losing millions and all of its subscribers so we got to somehow balance this over the past several months both dish and tv add-ons were getting ready to take the matter to trial well of course we don't want to go to trial because that means it's going to go to a jury so but that is no longer needed as the parties have signed a confidential settlement and agreement as a result dish decided to drop the case and sometimes the settlement can be considered a win for both sides. For economic perspective, ideal conclusion, a Canadian lawsuit has already destroyed our financial resources. I really don't know what kind of money you're going to get out of TV add-ons because um, as I go to the TV add-ons website, this is what they unfortunately have to be down to. They host the website. Uh, they got, uh, you know, news. They have... Beware of Cody add-ons, install Cody to iPad, and unrestricted Cody. They're going to have to give out notices, but here, the Dish Network directly on their website. The Dish Network Cody add-on lawsuit in the USA is settled, and they're saying that no data user info had to be exchanged with regards to this. Uh-oh. Hold on. Let's see if I can pull that one back up. No. Uh... I don't know what the problem is, but you saw that I read it right off of uh, Torn Freak as they gave you all of the news. I thought maybe here on their website and uh, Zem TV that there would be more information with regards on their own websites. Uh, but as you can see here, when I go directly to the website, click on the Dish Network. Currently, the site cannot be reached. Uh, maybe they're updating the article. I'm not sure. Beware of Cody add-ons phishing. Nope. 
that's the same problem as well. Server IP address could not be found. All right, that's strike two. Um, how about we try an older one? Let's see what's going on with the website. Uh-oh, well, <laughs> I don't know if that's part of the lawsuit or a glitch, but you've seen that I gave it uh, three tries and their site could not be reached currently. So I'm sure as part of the agreement, apparently we're gonna to have to make some uh, new changes as we go forward with regards to TV add-ons and so forth. This is a big lawsuit, but the most important fact is that the user data and info is not exchanged. Uh, so that's a good thing. So we are told, come on over to the Jack Power channel, hit the subscribe link if you've not already. And then uh, if you do not want your data or user taken from any other location, make sure you VPN it right there immediately or this will be you at some point with regards to a settlement copyright infringement lawsuit. We don't want that to happen, not at all. Well, that's today's immediate breaking news that we cannot reach directly from TV add-ons for any conf... Let's see, I'll try it one more time before I leave. Uh, uh, no. Can't get it. Something's up with them. But I can get it over here. All right. Well, there you go. Settlement USA has been settled. You Canadians, stay tuned as more information coming down the pipeline. I'll keep you informed. I'm Jack Bauer channel and a Jack Bauer YouTube. As you can see all the stories here I've been covering lately because there's just been so many. All right, well, this is a TV ad, an addition network settlement done for USA. All right, we'll see what happens next.